Hi, my name is uh, Olaf. I will show you the Adafruit uh, NeoPixel clone from uh, AliExpress. Uh, I guess you can also buy it from eBay or Banggood or other sources. Uh, I will connect it to the ESP8266 uh, Arduino compatible uh, Wi Fi, uh, I don't know, SOC. <laughs> um, I hope you understand my uh, Norwegian English dialect. Um, yeah, so this is it, I guess. Um, here's the NeoPixel ring. Then I soldered uh, four wires over here. Um, at first, I thought that D D one and D zero, but actually it's the D I data in and uh, D O data out. Uh, you don't really need to solder DO uh, if you're only running one pixel. You can run multiple of these uh, and you can daisy chain them by going from out to in. So you would put this into the next one. Um, I only have one though, so I can show you that. Uh, this is the ESP266 or uh, Node MCU1. Um, it's running the latest firmware and uh, and I put on the Adafruit uh, example library for their new pixel. Uh, this is 24 pixel one. You can actually see some hints down here. Uh, 24. I don't know if you can read it. So yeah. Yes, that's it. You would of course wire up three wires. Uh, and I also have two wires here that will uh, emulate a momentary switch. Um, so it's uh, yeah, it's really quick to start trying this out. So to test it now, we will only need the power source. So if I put this into my power bank, like so, now it's ready to go since I already programmed it. So if I take this switch emulator, what should you call it? And yeah, there we go. And there are 10 animations in this library. And uh, the next color should be blue. Now we're through animations. Looks quite good. Very fluent animations, lights and uh, rich colors. It's very bright. It's, uh, my lenses are get they get this uh, blinded effect. <laughs> so yeah, and, uh, the reason you see this IKEA bowl bowl lamp thingy, I thought about putting it like this, and then you can uh, make this. Uh, quite fancy internet controlled uh, mood lamp or whatever. I guess you could show uh, a pollution in your area. Uh, it could be green if you can go outside or red if you have to stay inside. Um, you could show the noise level in your room or uh, of course you could use the, the light with distance meter like ultrasonic sensor or some other way to uh, meter the distance. You could show uh, how far you are off your target or pixel clock or yeah, there are many, uh, many ways to use it. It looks quite good I think. It's almost a kind of neon effect with the colors. I would say this lamp is probably the ideal uh, IKEA lamp, I guess, for uh, for the NeoPixel or NeoPixel clone. That's it, I guess. We run through the ten cycles. You can, of course, start up again if you wish. And uh, yeah. so it's quite cool. It'll take you five minutes to get started.
that's it. I think this is my first uh, first video uh, speak talking. Um, hope you survived my uh, my terrible accent. <laughs> I haven't had English classes for many years, so yeah, bye.